This wall is a textbook. It becomes a way to put literally paint on a wall to open up a new chapter in the history of Columbia. This mural project helps to recreate just one phase, one component of the African American Business District. This mural is a striking reminder of an extraordinary community and an extraordinary group of African American professionals who, despite segregation, built a world for themselves. And so it's a tribute to those who helped to build this city, a tribute to those who were successful entrepreneurs, and a tribute to those customers uh, who came downtown, who came from across the Midlands uh, to this part of the community. These murals help us understand the persistence of a young woman named Sarah Mae Fleming, who simply wanted to sit on a seat on a bus, not realizing that when she challenged segregation on that bus, she would be writing a new chapter in the history of this nation. We always seek to tell the human story. We feel totally honored, totally honored to be presenting this subject matter, this topic, this theme, um, because it's just that, it's just that important. Uh, the neighbors here in the neighborhood, some know of the story, some don't know the story. So even just this past week of painting these strokes up on this wall, it's not even done yet, but um, people are hearing maybe for the first time or, or reaffirming some of the things that they knew once before about Sarah Mae Fleming. And um, that's beautiful because if it's happening in this short span of a week, then it's going to happen for years to come just from a wall. Whenever I do a piece like this, I hope uh, for the children to see and say, who is that? You know, and go find them and learn their story. Uh, it's important to understand how African Americans fought for the right to vote. And who were those African Americans who did that? The New Freedom Project usually does kind of our signature thing of incorporating African tradition, cloths, and we've intertwined um, community leaders. I love, you know, the thought of taking on a project that has such meaning to it. This is the first, um, the first class that was integrated into uh, Rosewood Elementary. I feel like it's important to represent people of color in the community. And so all of this artwork helps us to fill in gaps. It helps us to um, fill in some of the silences of our history and hopefully educate a new generation of people about the extraordinary history of African Americans in Colombia.